Remember, Sanford police were called out twice to resolve arguments between the victim, Latina Herring, and her boyfriend, Alan Cash, that night before Herring was shot to death in the early morning hours of March 27th. Police body cam footage shows the last known moments between the couple. This is around 3.30 a.m. last Monday. This is the second time police were called out about an argument over keys to Latina Herring's home. The suspect, Alan Cash, tells officers he doesn't have them, and as you can see, they are patting him down looking for them. In parts of the video, you can also see him detained in the back of a police car. But eventually, police accompany Cash inside the home to retrieve his personal belongings, and then he and the victim, Herring, part ways. Herring apparently tried to give him a bag of his personal items, which Cash refuses. Police later find a gun in that plastic bag. Now, just hours later, Cash allegedly returned to the home with an AK-47 and shot not only his girlfriend, Latina Herring, but her two kids, their grandfather, and two more innocent bystanders at a nearby bus stop. Herring died at the scene. Her eight-year-old son passed away later at the hospital. The other victims, we're told, are still recovering. Now, there's controversy around why the officers didn't take a more proactive stance to prevent this tragedy. Again, we just received the body camera footage. We'll be pouring through that, as well as the 911 calls. We'll have more details tonight at 5 and 6. Tiff.